My name is Maria Nunez, and this is my meiosis movie project. Meiosis is a type of cell division that produces haploid gametes, sex cells containing single sets of chromosomes, from diploid cells, cells containing two homologous or matched pairs of chromosomes, one from each parent. Meiosis begins with a duplication of chromosomes in an interphase. At the end of this interphase, each chromosome consists of two genetically identical parts, called sister chromatids, attached at their centromere. The purple ribbon represents the chromatin, the combination of DNA and proteins that make up chromosomes. The yellow play-doh and twist tags represent the cell's centrosome, the material in the cytoplasm that gives rise to microtubules, which also duplicates during this interphase. Early in prophase 1, the first stage of meiosis 1, the chromatin coils up and starts to form individual chromosomes, as shown with the purple ribbon. Matching pairs of chromosomes come together in a process called synapsis, and the resulting structure is called a tetrad. During synapsis, chromatids, two identical parts of a homologous chromosome, exchange segments in a process called crossing over. Crossing over rearranges genetic information because the versions of the genes on a chromosome may be different from those on its matching chromosome. As prophase 1 continues, the chromosomes condense further as the nucleoli, represented by the blue plato, disappears. The centrosomes move away from each other, and the spindle forms between them, as displayed with the yellow plato and twist ties. The light purple Play-Doh represents the nuclear envelope fragmenting. The chromosome tetrads, purple ribbons, attached to spindle microtubules, yellow twist ties, are moved toward the center of the cell. At metaphase 1, the second stage in meiosis 1, the chromosome tetrads are aligned midway between the two poles of the cell on the metaphase plate, red toothpicks. Spindle microtubules, yellow twist ties, are attached to the connecticores, specialized protein structures at the centromere region of a sister chromatid which are represented by the dark purple play-doh on top of the purple ribbons. In each tetrad, the matching chromosomes are held together at sites of crossing over, but they are ready to separate because they are attached to spindle microtubules, yellow twist ties, from opposite poles of the cell. Anaphase 1, the third stage of meiosis 1, is marked by the movement of chromosomes toward the two poles of the cell. The sister chromatids making up each double chromosome remain attached at their centromeres. Only the tetrads, pairs of homologous chromosomes, split up. In the picture, there are two double chromosomes, purple ribbons, moving toward each spindle pole. In telophase 1, the last stage of meiosis 1, the chromosomes arrive at the poles of the cell. Each pole of the cell has a haploid chromosome set, and each chromosome still consists of two sister chromatids, purple ribbons. Cytokinesis, the division of the cytoplasm to form two separate daughter cells, occurs during telophase 1, and two haploid daughter cells are formed. Chromosome duplication does not occur between telophase 1 and the onset of meiosis 2. In organisms having an interphase after meiosis 1, the chromosomes condense again and the nuclear envelope, like purple play-doh, breaks down during prophase 2, the first stage of meiosis 2. A spindle forms, yellow twist ties, and moves the chromosomes, purple ribbons, toward the middle of the cell. During metaphase 2, the second stage of meiosis 2, the chromosomes align on the metaphase plate, red toothpicks. With the connectochores, dark purple play-doh on top of the purple ribbon, of the sister chromatids for each chromosome pointing toward opposite poles of the cell. In anaphase 2, the third stage of meiosis 2, the centromeres of sister chromatids finally separate, and the sister chromatids of each pair, now individual daughter chromosomes, move towards opposite poles of the cell, purple ribbons. The final stages of meiosis 2, telophase 2, and cytokinesis occur at the same time. Now there are four daughter cells, each with a single haploid set of chromosomes. Meiosis produces daughter cells with half as many chromosomes as a parent cell. This meiosis movie project was directed by Maria Nunes.